Hi guys, I am Diksha and welcome back to my channel. So I am going to Assam Downtown University where I am pursuing my PhD. I have recently completed my coursework and the results are out. I have no idea about my marks so I am going to collect the mark sheet and also I am going to meet my supervisor. I have some important discussions regarding my upcoming uh, synopsis and uh, sample collection and everything. So keep watching the video and please subscribe my channel if you like my videos. We need to take the Guwahati Chandrapur road from Narangi to reach the university. Back in 2017-2018 when I was doing my MSc, the road condition was just not like this. Uh, but now the road condition is superb so it hardly takes 15 minutes to reach the university from Narangi. This is the entrance gate. There are several buildings, several blocks for different disciplines. So this is the main block uh, and I am going to get my mark sheet in this only because this is the administration block. Now heading towards another block where we will meet our supervisor. This was so sweet of my friend. Uh, she made my video while roaming around the campus. This is a newly constructed block. This is very beautiful and it is specifically for the science students like BSc and MSc in various subjects like biotechnology, microbiology and all. So we have met our supervisor successfully. Now it's time to eat and drink something. This part of the university is so beautiful. There are bells and an idol of Saraswati Ma. So this looks very very divine. Um, okay, so we are done with all our works. We have made our supervisor. We have collected our mark sheets and now it's time to go. After waiting for a, a very long time, I have finally received my mark sheet. Uh, the results are not bad. My CGP is 8.44 and the result is pass. Actually, the uh, marks really doesn't matter. Uh, all that matters is uh, you have passed or not in the coursework. Uh, so fortunately, I have passed. Uh, and my purpose to meet my supervisor was also uh, worth it. Okay, so as promised in the beginning of the video, now I'll be sharing some important information regarding PhD admission in Assam Downtown University. So the admissions uh, take place in two sessions. And like most of the UGC recognized universities, Assam Downtown University also organized an entrance examination uh, in order to get admission in the PhD uh, for each uh, session. Uh, the entrance examination is called ADTURET. You will get ev each and every information in their, in their official website uh, about the entrance examination. Uh, the application fees for, uh, filling, up that uh, for filling up that form uh, is 1000 rupees. The eligibility criteria for uh, getting admission is uh, not only that entrance examination test but also you have to uh, secure 55 percent marks in your post graduation in any uh, stream in any uh, faculty like maybe it may be faculty of science faculty of arts commerce uh, whatever but a 55 percent marks in your post graduation is important to get the admission so the list of uh, candidates those who have qualified the uh, exam um, is published in their official website and also it will be mailed to your particular mail id which you will provide in while filling up that application form after qualifying and after getting the result that you have qualified the exam then you will go for coursework the coursework is of uh, six uh, six months and it is extremely important and mandatory for everyone the subjects which are common for every subject is uh, research methodology. This is the book which I uh, referred while I was preparing for my coursework. This is C. R. Kothari's and Gaurav Garg's research methodology. It the second subject is statistics and computer. Uh, computer. Uh, so there. Uh, you can purchase any statistics, any book, a good book of statistics, and also uh, you can also uh, search some uh, basic like mean, median, mode in uh, YouTube. Uh, YouTube is also very beneficial in uh, studying statistics. The uh, another very important subject, which is very very important for every PhD scholar, is uh, research ethics. 
the main motto of keeping this subject in the coursework is that uh, the research scholar should not deviate at any point of their uh, research work uh, should not deviate from the ethical practices we should not implement any kind of unethical practice while uh, preparation of our dissertation or while carrying our research work so apart from this common subjects uh, there is another uh, there is another very important paper which is the uh, literature survey uh, this will not be a theory paper rather there will be a uh, presentation of your topic of interest which uh, whatever topic you have selected for your research work uh, you have to make one presentation of why you have selected the topic and uh, how you will uh, how you will carry out your work uh, and all so um, that is the after completion of the coursework there will be a phase where you have to submit your synopsis synopsis means uh, whatever you are going to do your synopsis is a smaller version of the main dissertation this was it this was not a very detailed information although i uh, didn't want to make the video very very long if you want to know something more uh, then please comment down in the comment section uh, as because i am also in the initial stages i have not yet completed my synopsis and all so uh, include the video here only so i hope the video was helpful enough thanks for watching my video this was a kind of long video but uh, Anyways, thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe my channel and uh, please watch my upcoming videos. Bye guys, take care.